Hey everybody, the Banga's back. Let's play Chrono Trigger Park 41. Yeah, I decided to go back to 1000 AD and pick up the Tabin Helm, which actually gives Luca a good bit of magic defense, though it's not the best helmet she got. So anyways, let's uh, back to Zeal Palace and actually get there. Yeah, let's go. Fully. Why is the Prophet all allowed inside while well, I'm stuck with guard duty? Ha, there you are. I'll let the Prophet go, knowing he'd mess up sooner or later. But I have no use for you anymore. Your history! Oh yeah? We'll see about that. Let's see how you like Luminaire action. Since we got Arbo Helms on, Lightning won't do too much damage to us. That is, if you are going to use lightning attacks. I don't think he will. I think he's just going to use the iron orb all the time. Yep, he is. Unfortunately. But that's okay. We still got Luminaire. Go ahead, try and attack. Now he's in counter mode, but we're going to attack him anyway. Not like he got an attack I got to worry about. Well, he was gonna use this anyway, so what do I gotta worry about? Eventually he'll drop. You just gotta keep healing every once in a while. Say it like this. You don't stand a chance against the most powerful magic in the game. See? No, your burps are deadly. Oh, seriously, they are. Took a bit of damage. No, I'm going to be immortal. I can't be beaten now. Yeah, you can. Oh, he's gonna head to the Ocean Palace, eh? Guess we're going there too. Go. Oh, it looks nicely done. This is 12,000 BC too, quite advanced. Okay, now that we're in the Ocean Palace, I think I'm going to take Ala out and put Luca in. The black energy grows, something scary is waking up. Wouldn't surprise me. Shala, raise the power of the man machine to its limit. Shala, you dare to disobey me? All right, mother. Oh, what bright splendor! The incredible power of Lavos. Ah. <laughs> uh, Prophet seems to be worried about her. I wonder why, hint, hint. Actually, let's take Marla out and put Rob in. And scouters, not the same scouts from Dragon Ball Z either. And since they are yellow, they are weak against lightning. The red ones are weak against fire, and the blue ones are weak against water. That's something for you to keep in mind. Any other magic attack will heal them. Physical attacks don't seem to do much damage. Oh, Rune Blade. Let's see, let's see. Yep, that's better. Actually, instead of Raw, Raw, I'm gonna put Frog in. Let's look around for some switches, which I believe are over here. Okay, now here's the two new enemies there the Jins and the Vargas. Now the Bargus turns as the Jin's shield. You kill the Bargus, and the Jin is wide open for attack. But you can't attack the Jin while the Bargus is still on the field. Otherwise you're not going to do any damage. Oh, you will, but very little. Yeah, now the shield is destroyed and you're wide open. There we go. That's how you get the job done. Delta Storm. Nice. 
Uh oh, mages. I highly suggest you take those guys out quickly. They can be a bitch if you're not careful. Yeah, I did the job. Since we're gonna be Luke, using Luca a lot for magic, I might as well give her something new. Instead of the magic ring, yes, he'll lose a bit of power, but I'm gonna put the silver stud on you anyway. That way, we have to use less points. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, and he has suit too. Uh, take out the load vest. And let's go over here. It ties our arm, but we put that before I forget. Well, at least I'm picking up lots of weapons. What if I went this way? I heard there was something secret around here. Oh, wait, that's for the other side. We'll do this from the left, not the right. Okay, there's one of the main switches I had to activate. Something happened. Now, if you want to get in a battle, step on these diamonds over here. See? There we go. Now we got ourselves an enemy battle. Uh, skin cut on the mage, water on blue scouts, and just use a normal fire attack on the red one. That's being systematic with your strategies. We all know the system works. Oops, that's, I supposed to trigger a switch over there in the upper left corner of the main room. Otherwise I can't get here. Might as well do that now. Just in case I forget. Oops. Got in the battle. Okay, it's just you three. There. Just like that. Usually I'll fast forward battles that I know I'll end in one hit. Oops. More enemies. Okay, Frog, let's see if you got water to learn. Do you? Yep, you do. Drown them now. Nicely done. Oot. I'll trigger this switch. I could have just gone on and made progress, but there's a weapon I can pick up right here, and I needed to do this. Just to get there. Uh oh. Muscle fusion. When they're right near each other, they do a special attack. There. Now we can finish him off. I like some music here in the Ocean Palace. It really gives you that epic feel, like something big is about to happen. And well, it pretty much is. Oops, not you again. I'll just use a cyclone and water too will pick you up. There you go, now you can kill all three. Ooh, a star sword. Should I use it now? Yes, I should. That's good. Oop, another chest. Shockwave. Jeez, I'm getting good weapons for everybody and inflict random chaos. Not bad. I can use this to promote my stream channel, The Domain of Chaos, on Justin.tv. Be sure to check it out. It's pretty much www.justin.tv slash my YouTube name. Plain and simple. There's nothing else you need to know. Uh, two times hit for magic enemies. I'll lose a bit of magic, but doing more damage to magic enemies? Why not? That's always fun. Okay, there's the main room I gotta go to. Let's 
right over here. Okay, I gotta fight some more enemies. The Thrasher and a couple scouts. Since I'm running out of time, I'm gonna fast forward most of this. Just for the sole purpose of keeping up with time. Okay, I got enough to finish this. So yeah, I'm going to stop the video right here and I'll continue the Ocean Palace in the next part. Goodbye.